up it's matt with galaxy games 843 we are in tennessee and it's the auction morning it's time to do a preview walkthrough yeah lots of stuff here today guys but it's still it's not your typical auction there's not as many things today it's a little bit lighter so we're going to do a walk around we're going to show you what is going to be auctioned off but before we do i want to remind everyone to subscribe to the channel it's galaxy games 843 here on youtube we will have a full-blown auction coverage video tomorrow which is sunday february 21st sometime in the afternoon all right, so we're gonna start walking around and showing everyone what is available and here are some of the jukeboxes guys and there's usually a lot more jukeboxes here so there's only a few jukeboxes here this morning so here we go let's do start doing a walk around let's see what we got so there's a mix of classics there's lots and lots of cranes there lots of claw machines guys so if you like claw machines today's video is going to be one you'll love um, but the first thing i want to show off here is a tempest and look at this it's a tempest with an original color vector monitor and it's in really nice shape it looks awesome good side art I'm sure it's heavy it's an Atari cabinet but it's cool here we got a Stargate some drivers this is kind of the driver row here so let's take a walk down the driver row let's see what afterburner climax transformers fast and the furious overdrive we got a Terminator 2 judgment day and a Star Wars Trilogy, 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 not trilogy, trilogy arcade cabinet. Oh, what else we got? Time Crisis 4, some Big Buck Hunter, some NASCAR racing, some Dead Heats. Those are always some cool games, those nitrous oxide games. Rush 2049. I feel like this Pirates game shows up at every auction. Here's some of the more rushes with LCD screens. This big Ghostbusters game and more drivers. Here's some classics over here, though, guys. We got a, well, first of all, we got a multi cave. We got a Radical Bikers, another multi, Area 51, Miss Pac Man. This Miss Pac Man looks like it's got an LCD in it. I don't know if it's got a multi board in it or not, but hard to tell. It might not have a multi board in it. Because typically you don't see all that. No, that's, that's going to be an original board, because typically you don't see all this stuff um, on a multi board. What else we got? We got another multi-K. We got a Miss Pac-Man and a Donkey Kong. This Donkey Kong looks pretty good. It's a plywood cabinet. Got some extra bolts on the sides. Needs a degauss. Look at that. Needs a degauss on the screen. But still cool. Love Donkey Kong. Neo Geo with an LCD screen in it. And a couple of vending machines. Here we go. Here's some vending snack machines. All right. So let's go up the next row. So this next row consists of a bunch of older claw machines, and some vending machines like vending racks and toy racks, things like that. Here we go. This is a red zone, kind of like one of those, um, those chicken games where you got to roll the ball up and try to stop it on the arrows. Um, a bling king, and look at all that bling in there, guys. <laughs> Big choice, some old coin pushers. More older claw machines. we got a stacker over there. Some tattoo sticker machines. What else we got? More stackers. This one's got the uh, the fruit vinyl wrap or the candy vinyl wrap around it. Some pirates chest machines. I always like those when I see them on location. Road trips. Prize locker. Here we go. Here's uh, here's all those vending racks I was talking about. Now in some previous videos we've done, we've actually opened these up and found money inside. But these ones say we have the keys. We have the keys, so that means there's not going to be money locked inside, guys. All right, barber cut, stacker, stacker. Another smart industries candy crane. We've got a plush bus, another winner's cube. There's something funny up here, though, guys. I got to show you this up here. Hold on, let's let's get up here. Hey, there's a there's a mini stacker. You know, we got one of those here previously, a mini stacker. Where's that funny thing though? Oh, here it is, okay. Before we get there, here's another mini stacker. Here's a key master, which you know we want to get it for our route one of these days. Another key master over there, but look at this plus bus. Plush bus. I want to show you the prizes inside, because you know I like to check out the prizes, right? <laughs> look at that, guys. Remember when the uh, big toilet paper shortage was going on? They had this thing full of toilet paper. Isn't that funny? All right. All right, on to the next row.
And guys, if you can see, if you can see this, throw some comments down there. I'm not sure if I'm if I'm getting my comments right now. If you are joining the live stream, throw some comments down there. Let me see if I can get the comments. I don't know if I'm getting them right now. All right, while we're walking in this road, this is like basically Crane Row, guys. Look at all these claw machines. And these are the newer ones. These are the ones that were, you know, you'll still see on location. So we got Toy Taxi, Big Choice, Toy Taxi, Hot Stuff. This is pretty cool. Those are like an egg machine. It's brand new, never used. Uh, another Barber Cut. Here's a Namco Capsule Factory. We had one of those back in the day. Another Dinosaur World, which is kind of like one of those fun chicken games. You know, you put the eggs inside. Lots and lots of claw machines today. Lots of stackers, too. So if you're looking for a claw machine, today's the day to buy a claw machine, guys. Alright, what else we got over here? We got another Winner's Cube. More claw machines. Alright, let's go on to the next row. Over there, there's some uh, dart machines, some punch machines. This row is kind of a mixture of stuff, guys. We got drivers. We got a virtual fighter converted to a shooting game. Track and field. Look at that track and field. Nice looking control panel on it. Doesn't have the side art. Remember running? What else we got? We got a Pac-Man Cabaret. It looks like it's converted to a multi-cade. Pretty cool. Area 51 in what looks to be a Killer Instinct cabinet. I can tell by that Nintendo art on the side of the control panel, but otherwise it looks like it's covered in vinyl. So I can't really tell what the original art is underneath. And I did check earlier, there's no identification stickers on the back. What else? What else is cool? There's an Area 51 Site 4, a couple 20-year reunion cabinets. Look like they could be projects. That one's got an LCD mounted in it. Galaga turn multi-cade, maybe? Yeah, it's, it's probably a home. I don't know. Who knows? A couple pedestals, another, another multi, another multi, more drivers. There's a Tetris project. And we're getting to the Golden Tea area and other, other drivers. All right, on to the next row. So this row, we got a Madden football, another NBA, NFL Showtime, NFL Blitz, some Daytonas. Here's a House of the Dead. Brett, if you're watching, there's your House of Dead, buddy. I know you like that game. Uh, Mario Kart, NASCAR. There's a Mach 3 laser game. Don't see those very often. I think we saw that actually in a previous auction, a couple, couple auctions ago. Here's an NFL Blitz that's in a Konami cabinet. Could have been a Turtles, you never know. But it looks like it's seen better days. Here's an actual Turtles, look at that. Uh, not too bad. Definitely, definitely restorable. It's a good project. Good project, Turtles. Here's a Missile Command. Let's take a look at that. Oh, guys, okay. Look at, check out that coin door. That coin door on the Missile Command should be a giveaway as to where this thing came from. Uh, let's see if there's any other. It looks like it's got an LCD screen in it. But comment down below if you know where this thing came from. There, I wonder if there's any identifying marks on the back. I might have to check it out. Yeah, I know where that came from. Somewhere in Florida, guys. Somewhere in Florida. Put it in the comments if you know where I'm talking about. All right, let's move on. We got another row plus the pinballs and the smallest table. All right, so in this row, we got a lighthouse machine, a couple cyclones. There's some prize lockers. Some more claw machines, a mixture of claw stuff. 
Here's the biggest gumball machine ever. A dunk tank, another barber cut. Some postcard photo machines. Some token stuff. A winner's cube. Look at that big behemoth, my goodness. Got some change machines up here. A kitty ride. Let's see what else we got. Here's the kitty ride. A talking parrot. Some, some more smaller vending machines. Coin pusher, winner's cube, another key master, plus a Disney themed claw machine. Man, I want one of those key masters. All right, let's move on. Let's walk around over here. Looks like we got the pins and the small stable. So let's go over the pins because everybody loves to see the pinball machines. Let's see what we got today in the pinball machines. While we're walking over here, guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, Galaxy Games 843 here on YouTube. The full blown auction coverage video will go live tomorrow. Sorry for the camera work there. All right, here we go. We got a Fishtails, we got a Baywatch, Funhouse, Shack. Then we got a, looks like a Gottlieb Royal Flush EM machine. Indiana Jones, Austin Powers, Whirlwind, that's a fun game. Got a Corvette here, Adams Family, High Speed. I know there was somebody looking for a high speed on the uh, Carolina Arcade Collectors group. Star Wars, WrestleMania, Terminator 3, and Road King. So not a lot of pin action today, guys. Not a lot of pin action today, but there's a few things there. It's kind of a lighter auction again today. I know there was probably some that were affected in the uh, other southern states that were uh, affected by the weather that probably couldn't make it today so that might play a factor in today's inventory let's go check out the smalls area now the smalls area is kind of like all the stuff that operators bring it's a lot of parts it's a lot of plush a lot of prizes let's go have a look around over there sometimes you'll find other touch tunes and stuff like that let's go take a look so I see some bags of jumbo plush, way too big for us. There's some boards over there we'll take a look at. Some speakers. <laughs> There's an arcade one-up. Another multicade there, and looks like a Pac-Man cocktail table. We got uh, a jukebox. Let's see. There's some ATMs. Some touch tunes, like project parts. What do we got over here? Some tabletop game machines. A laptop. <laughs> These are all prizes, guys. Like so, there's there's some uh, inflatable, looks like Cavalier balls. There's some basketballs over there. These are all kinds of different prizes. You can see like, these are all LeBron James, Steph Curry, all that kind of stuff. Soccer balls. All right, what do we got over here? We got coin doors for arcade machines manuals more coin doors 45s for jukeboxes more coin doors lots of coin doors here's kind of an all-around box of stuff we got a marshall champion marquee oh look at this we got a cubert marquee a miss pac-man zaxon mock rider i think Lots of stuff in there. That's kind of cool. Other little machines. There's some neons. All kinds of stuff, guys. Light bulbs for your marquees. <laughs> A bowling kit. All right, let's take a look at these boards. So we got TMNT Untested. Looks a little grody. So uh, I'm not sure that's going to be... It's probably not working. Uh, Mortal Kombat, Combat Tribes, Deer Hunter, Unknown. This one says Beast Hunter, Crime Fighters, Old School Unknown Tato, maybe Jungle King. That doesn't look like a Jungle King to me. Looks like a bootleg board or some sort. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, guys. Tecmo Football. That's kind of cool. More stuff over there. All right. Again, not a lot for the smalls. Not a lot for really a whole lot of anything. Um, again, I think the weather might be a play factor today, but I don't know, guys. I didn't see any comments, so I don't know if my comments are working.
But if you put comments in, I apologize. I did not see them. So let me give you one more reminder, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It's Galaxy Games 843 here on YouTube. The full-blown auction video will be live tomorrow, Sunday, February 21st, sometime in the afternoon. While you're subscribing, click that bell notification so that way you get a notification of when that video goes live and also our other videos and live streams as well. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up to like the video. And also, share the video with your friends. All right, well, that's about going to do it for our preview video walkthrough live stream this morning. Um, if there's any last questions, throw them in the comments while we're waiting. I'm just going to do a quick follow-up, and then we'll end the video, guys. Um, there's also going to be a preview video that I shot right before this live stream. It's currently uploading as we speak. I'm going to walk back over to the classic area one more time. There's not a lot of class classics here today, but we'll take a look and see. Hey, LPS Diamond, you say, oh, yeah. Thanks, LPS Diamond, for joining, and thanks for the comment. Let's see what we got over here. So while we're walking over here, the actual auction starts at 10 a.m. Eastern time here in Tennessee. So we'll be filming all day, and we will post the full-blown video tomorrow in the afternoon. All right, let's take a look at some of these classic machines. Here is a Neo Geo MBS. It's got an LCD screen. My personal favorite game, Donkey Kong. This one's pretty good. It's in nice shape. It's only got a few nicks in it. It's got an original, looks like Sanyo 20EZ monitor in there. It does need a degauss. But other than that, it looks pretty good. I love Donkey Kong. So who knows, guys? I'm not sure if I'm going to be taking anything home today. We'll have to see what the prices go for. When there's low inventory, Usually the prices are pretty high, so we'll see. I don't need any new, any new claw machines right now. So uh, we'll see what happens. All right, I don't see any other questions, guys, so it uh, looks like it's time to wrap this video up and finalize this live stream. So before we do that, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We really need your help getting to that. We're almost to 1,700 subs. Oh, wait, we got a question. LPS Diamond says, Miss Pac-Man, my favorite. Yeah, I'm, I have a feeling LPS Diamond can play a Miss Pac-Man anytime she wants. We'll see. All right. Let's go and wrap this video up, guys. Don't forget to, to subscribe to the channel. The full-blown full, full video will go live tomorrow, Sunday, February 21st. Give us a thumbs up to like the video, and don't forget to share our videos with your friends. Help us get to 1,700 subs, guys. We appreciate your help. All right. So let's go and wrap this video up, guys. It's Matt with Galaxy Games 843. We'll see you next time.